So for today, we're going to be looking at my SIVA inspired guardians. I have done the hunter one. I did change the helmet, but other than that, everything is the same. The Titan and Warlock are the new ones because I said I was going to do this video a long time ago and we're going to do it. So we're going to start off with my hunter. It'll be very, very short because again, I've already done that video. If you guys want to see that video and go through my original thoughts, then I'll have it linked right now. But essentially, uh, yeah, my hunter is going to be super fast. I'm just going to explain a few of my thought process and then we'll go to my tight end and my warlock that then we'll actually start talking about where my head was really going through because the tight end took me a while and the warlock kind of came to me really fast because I did do an electrical set not too long ago and I just kind of wanted to do that one. So if you guys like the video, like, comment, and subscribe it really does help the channel grow because a huge portion of people are not subscribed. So if you don't want me to to go to sleep crying, then a subscription would be very much appreciated and I would love you forever. So let's get into it. So this is my Hunter right here. As you guys can see, it's almost close to it. If not very close, just the helmet is completely different. I decided to use the Pylos following mask because Siva for me just immediately, my thoughts are just go as hard as you can in the edginess of it and make it look electrical and Siva fied. So for the helmet, obviously Apollo's following. I, I love this helmet. It's super edgy for the arms. We're using the interlaced grips specifically because I really like how the arm is just all wiring and whatnot. And I also love the other side is just like cloth kind of like it, for me. I think like when I see that cloth, it just makes me think like it's bandages. Like he's trying to like wrap himself and kind of like not show the electrical stuff even though one side is already super, super electrical and whatnot. For the chest piece, we're using the Nano Redux for the Radon Flux. It's one of my favorite chest pieces in the game to pair with Arc because it's literally one of the best. And this chest piece just looks amazing. This is literally what started the whole SIVA thing for me because I think Nano Redu or Red Redux is just looks so good. For the boots, we're using Legacy Oath stri Strides. I think if you really, really want to really want to like showcase that SIVA feel, then you're going to want to do the Deep Stone Crypt Raid because a lot of those pieces will look good with a SIVA look. For the for the cloak, this is where it gets weird because <clears throat> for me, when I see this cloak, I think immediately that this right here is a, a crown of wiring. So that's why I, I initially went with this helmet or with this cloak, because for me, that looks like wiring. The only unfortunate part is when you go through here, then you see the, the barnacles right here. I'm not the biggest fan of that. Uh, if you do want, you could actually just use the interlaced cape, which actually looks really cool. My only gripe with it is I don't like how the front looks of this. So that's really the only issue I have with this cloak is the fact that the front just looks pretty terrible. But again, if you want to use if you want to use this, I think it looks way better with it personally. So un unless until we get something better for the cloak that's actually wiring, then this is what I will be using because I did think about this one as well. But this is even worse. It looks like an egg. So that's pretty much it. You could actually use this one too. Maybe it kind of looks boring, but yeah, that's pretty much it uh, for the hunter. Let me know hunters what you guys think in the comments below. I definitely didn't change the shader. What the fuck? Uh, yeah, but yeah, let me know what you guys think hunters. Uh, I think it looks really cool Definitely one of my favorite looks right now for SIVA definitely if you're using this chess piece as well But let's get on to the Titans <clears throat> For the Titans we have the flex enhanced replicate uh, Ornament for Synthoseps, which I also will be using this for the Synthoseps video that I should be making But yeah, this is really cool in my opinion for the chess piece or the for the helmet for the helmet, we are using the Veritas helmet. I just love this helm. It's so good. Definitely frightening as fuck. For the arms, again, we're using the Flex Enhance Replicate ornament. For the chest piece, we're going to be using the Legacy. Oh, actually, let's do it all over again. For the Titan, we are using the Flex Enhance Replicate ornament for Synthoseps, which I will be using this set for the Synthoseps video that I will be making. Uh, because I think it looks really cool for the helmet. We're going to be using the Veritas helm. One of my favorite helmets for the Titans. Definitely super edgy and I love it. 
for the chess piece we're using the legacy oath plate you're going to see a trend i'm going to be using a lot of legacy oath stuff because it's the best piece for siva in my opinion for the boots we're going to be using the star cross footsteps specifically because of just how uh, muscular the armor looks don't get me don't get me wrong you can actually use the chess piece if you don't want to use the chess piece uh, blah, blah, blah. if you want you can use the star crossed heart chess piece instead of the legacy oath plate because I personally am not the biggest fan of the chess piece for this one because if I'm being honest you could do something like this which looks really cool or you can flip it around and actually use the this one and then the chest the boots for the other one so Murray this one you can do something like this which I actually think look this looks really cool as well it's just that when I when I was making this I in my head I was like oh I'm just gonna use this chess piece so I bought it and I don't have any more synth weave plates so you know yay for Bungie for limiting uh, my creativity because I can't buy anything else but you know it'd be like that for the mark we're also using the chem flesh mark because that, that honestly it looks edgy as fuck and again siva for me just lean into the edginess and it's gonna look good because siva's pretty edgy i'm not gonna lie I'm not i'm not even trying to be funny because i know siva like if you guys look at siva it is actually edgy like angular but <clears throat> even from like the armor from destiny one a lot of it did look really edgy so also you want to combine red with it red is very important uh, if you don't have red it with it, then you better have armor that looks like Siva, which we don't have in the game currently, as, uh, aside from the actual ornaments. So until we get a Siva season that we actually have Siva armor, this is the best we're going to be able to do. So Titans, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. For the mark, I'm going to be honest with you guys. The mark is going to be the hardest piece for you. You can do the phenotype plasticity because that is... Uh, vex and vex is kind of for me i i don't like to combine vex armor with siva because it just doesn't translate well in my head you could do that pile of following which i was thinking about doing but the mark kind of looks boring compared with everything else but maybe this one would look good uh yeah that actually does look pretty cool i'm not gonna lie mm, just you would just have to change the shader because i don't think the red plate lends itself well to it. You probably just want like really, yeah, something like this would be really cool because and then at that point, it kind of like just hides within itself. Uh, let me, let me actually put the shader. Cause again, I'm complete. I'm like, I'm like a hundred percent. Nah, I'm like 80% happy with it so far. Like, I don't think it looks terrible because I'm making this video. If I wasn't, if I wasn't make like, I wouldn't make this video if I didn't think it was cool. Cause I do think it's cool. Yeah. Like this looks cool. Like I actually do like this, but I do like the chain a little bit more. So we're going to have that here. So Titans, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. What would you guys be doing differently? I do think, Oh, Titans, you do have another piece that is Siva, but I don't have that ornament. Uh, if you guys are wondering which one it is, let me show you guys real quick. Just, just in case you guys are like, I don't want to use that one. Uh, it is, I think. No, it's, it's uh, Phoenix Cradle. Phoenix Cradle here. Yeah. This is the other one that you guys have, which I'm really jealous because I'd, be, I'd actually be using this one instead. I I, I very I much prefer this one over Synthoseps. I think Synthoseps just looks pretty bad, but this looks really cool. So hopefully Bungie brings this back because I definitely will, will use this. Oh. What? Why is this here? This is path. This is for the path of burning steps. That's weird, huh? Okay. So yeah, Titans. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, next one is warlocks. And last but not least, warlocks. We have the Siva inspired armor. I spe I specifically have been waiting for a Siva armor piece for warlocks to come, so that way I can make this video. And thankfully, this season was it. This season. It was this season, right? It was this season. Okay. Yeah, this season we ended up getting the replicated exploit for the necrotic grip, which looks really cool. Let's start from the head and down. So first and foremost, we're going to be using the legacy oath cow. Now, I know people are going to give me shit for using the legacy oath cow with the legacy oath boots, but in my defense, I don't care. It looks really good, right? Like how it is right now. And honestly, there's other pieces I could be using. I could use this one, this does not look terrible with it i could use this one i could use this one although personally for me 
I am not the biggest fan of combining Vex pieces with Siva because Vex has a very distinct look and so does Siva. So it just doesn't translate well in my head, but something like this is also kind of okay, I guess, maybe, I don't know. I probably wouldn't pair it with that one specifically, but again, there's pieces that I would be able to use. It's just that I like this helmet a lot more specifically because it just looks like a helmet that something that would be turning into siva would have obviously like you would have siva crystals up here and whatnot going through the helmet and whatnot but we don't have that in the game so this is the best i can do for the arms again we're using the replica exploit i love them they look really cool i just wish that this right here wasn't like that i wish it actually went into the into the uh arm a little bit better like as in this wasn't like this and it just went in i don't know it's hard to explain hopefully I, you guys know what i'm talking about for the chess piece interlaced robes is going to be the best thing for here because literally the half of the whole thing is all electrical this is probably the best thing for you if you want to do a siva look because it this looks really good with it for the boots like i said we're using legacy oath boots because i just think it looks really good with it and if you guys haven't noticed i've literally used legacy oath boots for all of the classes because they all look really good with it but again, if you are interested, you could use the Legacy Oath Cloak, which I'm not the biggest fan of, but you could probably make it work. It actually doesn't look terrible, actually. Like, it really looks cool. And then you could probably just switch them out for these, which that doesn't look terrible, bro. Like, I actually, I'm being genuine. It does not look terrible. And I hate this, I hate this chest piece. Like, I don't like it at all, but this looks pretty cool. So you do have options. Just be aware that the options you have are legacy oath boots and the interlaced robes. And for a lot of people that weren't here for season of uh, the splicer, this might be a little rough because this is the actual season pass ornament. So at that point, you could probably do the psionic speaker robes, maybe. Uh, but if you're watching this in the future and you didn't get either of those, then your best bet would honestly just be to use the legacy oath boots with oh man let's see what what is available currently maybe the braid tech researcher stuff would be pretty cool with it and then obviously changes the shader my own so like the only thing that you have to worry about when you have when you have a when you're trying to do a siva look is you're gonna want to stay away from cloth because it doesn't look good with Siva, in my opinion. Uh, Siva looks really good with pieces that are just fully armored or electrical pieces. So something like this is not going to look good because of the of the cloth. Same thing with this one. Uh, same thing with this one. So the boots is going to be the hardest part for you because even even this, yeah, too much cloth. I'm not even I'm not even saying like this actually looks good because it doesn't look like cloth. This is more leather. But again, actually, what about the chest piece for that one? Well, that's from the raid, which is currently unavailable, but mm, not a fan, not a fan. That's even, uh, I'm, if you don't have anything else, but you have this armor set, I think this would be okay. Uh, Last but not least, for the, let me switch back. Yeah, there we go. For the bond, we're actually using the Thorium Halt because it has wiring. <laughs> That's pretty much it. So I know this is very close. Actually, I think this is almost a one-to-one -one of the electrical look I made for that one video, which I'll have in the screen right now. But again, I wanted to showcase the SIVA look, which is just changing the arms pretty much for this one and the shaders. The shaders, obviously I'm di using almost different shaders for all of them because I don't want red to be all over the place. I just want red to be accents almost, but even though like the robe is almost all red, but yeah. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. I really like doing the SIVA video. This was a lot of fun. Uh, took me way faster than I thought it would be actually. It took me like maybe 30, 40 minutes to do everyone. Uh, although the Hunter, I already made a video for that and the Warlock and Titan. I, I kind of had a general idea where I wanted to go with it, so. Let me know what you guys think. Are you guys going to be rocking the SIVA look anytime soon? Let me know in the comments below. I will be making a SIVA slash Iron Lords inspired armor where it's SIVA armor with 
Iron Lord armor, obviously. So I'll be making that video probably next week. If anything, if it goes fast enough, I might actually just record it right now, but we'll see. But be safe and I'll see you guys later.